I got a back plate on it and basically it just wait takes a long time for it to come back up it doesn't seem to have a rhyme or reason when it comes up so it seems to seem the problem is that uh, the rear axle is uh, very low on hydraulic fluid Right now, this lever, when you put this lever all the way up, down, down, up, push the up, push the lift up, but uh, actually needs some more hydraulic fluid. Okay, first we're going to take this guy off. A lovely quick disconnect, if only we had the cool backhoe. Take this guy off. I already loosened it before. Actually, we'll take this one up here first. Good. Pop them off here. Try not to let any goo fall into the rear axle here. Good. There, I got this little container I'm going to use as like a sort of half-ass funnel, though I'm seeing these corners. Okay, we're going to have to go like that. Let's uh, check it out. Too much, so we can test her out. And then let's pour it in. They say on the documentation that. Uh, okay, so the proper levels for this right here you'll see it says rear axle with the hydraulic lift arms raised and with the external equipment ram cylinders fully extended that's if you had a, a backhoe or something on there well, basically all the all the cylinders out as far as they go then it should be level the level should reach the level plug hole which the level plug hole is here we'll zoom in a little bit So it is this little bolt right here. So you can kind of just, once you lift it up, take this off, and the fluid should be level with that hole. So it shouldn't be coming out, but it should be just about to come out. And that's when you know you yeah, got enough fluid in your transaxle in the back there, which moves your uh, these arms up and down to lift your three-point hitch. Definitely taking a lot, and I don't see I'm probably gonna have to buy a whole nother bottle. Definitely low, so good news about that is that's should be my problem. Yeah. Cannot see any in there, really. So that's what we're filling it with. Good old tractor juice from a uh, Walmart. Put about a gallon in it so far. It doesn't seem like it's moved much. So, all right. So, in conclusion, that did uh, actually fix the problem. It uh, lifts and lowers just fine now. So, if you're having that problem, you just gotta put some hydraulic oil in the rear axle there. And originally, I thought you had to put it to the top level, but you have to put it to the level that plug on the side on the, the right side of the tractor down near the lift lever a little bit there you see like I said earlier you just want to fill it till it's almost coming out of that uh, thing and then start being able to lift your three-point hitch up and down 
Hope this helped. Uh, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Have fun.